Hey everyone, hope you're all doing well. Today we are going to be talking about the polishes that I picked up for Polish Pickup for the month of January. I wanted to make a quick announcement here that if, for those of you that may not know, I'm going to be changing up how I do my Polish Pickup videos for a little while. I had a little bit of a setback with this hand surgery. I had an additional thing happen and I don't have full functionality of one finger in that surgery hand, so I have it taped up and everything, and I didn't want to try doing swatches for this particular video just because trying to hold on to the swatch wheel and not move that finger in the incorrect way was going to be a little tricky for me. So what I decided to do for this video is I'm going to hold the polishes up, talk about them, and then I'm going to insert swatch photos that were from polish pickup so you could see what the polishes look like in a nice large photo. With that being said, let's go ahead and get into it. I have five polishes to share with you. The first one we're going to talk about is this one by Color Spectrum Polish. This is called Purple Poison. This is a really pretty deep violet base. It has blurple iridescent flakes and purple to pink to blue Aurora Shimmer. I'm looking at my list to see what the description is. Uh, this is a really beautiful polish. With that aside, this is a really pretty polish. My husband loves purple. I love a good purple polish, but this one I felt like I had something similar in my collection. Upon further investigation, I'm like, well, I don't know if I have anything quite like this. Not really sure. I'd have to do a little bit more research. I may have something very similar, but you can really see a lot of that shifty shimmer in here. Looking at the bottle, you can see that pink to blue to purple color shifting shimmer against that base. This is a really pretty polish. The next one is, I think, a new to me brand. I don't recall if I have anything from this brand. This is by Paradox Polish, and this is called Wisteria. This is a beautiful polish, and I knew once I saw it on Polish Pickup last month, I had to get it. This is such a gorgeous polish. It is a cornflower blue Corelli base with color-shifting iridescent flakes and some holographic sparkle. I was looking at this in person, and I cannot get over how large some of those flakies are with this one. They are just gigantic. You get so many gorgeous color shifting flakies in here. This is just so pretty, especially for the spring. The next one is by Rogue Lacquer, and this is Bleeding Hearts. My camera is definitely making this look a lot brighter than what it is in person. This is a pale green base, strong pink to gold Aurora shifting shimmer. This one initially I was not that gung-ho about, I didn't think it was going to look good on me, and the more I saw the swatches, I thought, I'm going to add that one just because it's beautiful. I think this would be a beautiful polished add for my spring rack. I think this is going to be perfect for that. I've seen so many people talk about it, and Mercedes from Hey Mercedes, her swatch pictures just made me want this even more when I saw it initially. This is absolutely beautiful. This next one I knew I had to pick up when I saw it. This is Night Owl Lacquer's Winter Rose, and this is a linear hollow polish, but it is in a charcoal base. I almost thought it was like a brown base, but it does look to be charcoal, almost brown in person. I don't have anything like this in my current collection, and knew when I saw it, I had to add it. I had one that I thought was close from Cupcake Polish, but... That was a little bit of a disappointing polish, and I saw this one and thought, I'm going to have to get it. You can see all of that rainbow shiftiness going on here. This is such a beautiful polish. Absolutely gorgeous. This is Wildflower Lacquer's Dark Beauty. This polish has been popping up on Facebook for people that have already received their orders, and they're like, this is gorgeous, this is a one coat polish, and I'm thinking, hold up here, <laughs> one coat, sign me up. So I had to pick it up. This was a choice my husband made. I, like I said, wasn't initially drawn to this, but you could see all of that gorgeous glow in this polish. So many different color shifts in here. I In the pictures, I couldn't see all that. I don't think I paid that close attention. So when I saw it initially, I was not drawn to it, but I am so happy that I have this because she is absolutely gorgeous. So that is it, guys. That is everything that I picked up in January. Hope you have a great rest of your week. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.